Hi there, and thank you for your interest in the Lotus Notes connector for Salesforce.com from iEnterprises. iEnterprises have been delivering solutions that integrate email and CRM since the 1990s. We've won numerous awards as depicted here on the screen. We also have hundreds of customers with tens of thousands of users. Some of them are also depicted here on this screen. So let's start by talking about the email integration. The email integration lets you copy emails from your inbox to the CRM. And we have something that's called email caller ID that automatically detects the sender of the email message and then files it in the CRM under the appropriate contact. But you can also associate emails to accounts and opportunities and even custom objects. So they're filed correctly in the CRM and you can find them at a later date. You can also address emails in the Lotus Notes client from your CRM data. So select contacts and add them to the two and the CC and the BCC and so on. And you can even see a summary of the contact information from within notes mail, as well as launch a 360 degree view of all of the information about the contact or account right from your notes mail. So it brings everything inside your inbox. Let's go to the live demo and see it in action. Okay, so here's my Lotus Notes inbox, and you can see I've received a message from one of my customers. I'll open the message, and you can see also that there's a new area uh, inside Notes Mail that allows me to interact with my CRM directly from Notes. If I click Select, it will automatically detect the sender of the message, file the message in my CRM under the appropriate contact and company automatically without any work whatsoever. I can also associate this message with other objects inside salesforce.com, such as opportunities and cases, and even custom objects. I can also quickly and easily see more information about this contact in the CRM, and even update it right from Lotus Notes. And if that's not enough, I can actually open the record itself inside of the CRM very quickly and easily with the click of a button and adjust it as I see fit. And for new messages, I can select the appropriate contact from salesforce.com and send the message, thus saving it in salesforce.com as it's sent out of Lotus Notes. All right, so now on to the calendar synchronization piece. So the Lotus Notes connector lets you create new calendar items right on your notes calendar, and then it copies and synchronizes those with your CRM. It also lets you associate the calendar item to a contact, account, opportunity, or even a custom object. And if you create calendar items or events in the CRM itself, it will pass those to your notes calendar so they'll appear on your notes calendar. And it actually does a two-way synchronization as well. So both your notes calendar and your CRM calendar are always up to date regardless of which one you enter the information in. And you can address invitees from, uh, from the CRM from within the notes calendar and see a summary of contact information and other details uh, about this item and the associated contacts and so on from the CRM. Let's check it out in the live demo. So here's my Lotus Notes calendar, and you can see right here is a meeting that actually came from the CRM. So meetings that are actually created inside the CRM automatically appear on my Lotus Notes calendar, and they're synchronized as the day goes on. Um, and perhaps I'd like to create a meeting first thing in the morning to meet my customers. So uh, I'll demo that by just double clicking on my calendar at 9 a.m. tomorrow. And you can see much like the email integration, there's a piece of the user interface here that actually lets you interact with salesforce.com directly from your notes calendar. So let me select from salesforce.com the customer that I'd like to meet with. Okay, so it's Adam Jotley, and I'll just type in his last name and search for it. And you'll see that it comes up. He works for GenePoint. Click OK. And now uh, this new calendar uh, item is actually associated with Adam Jotley at GenePoint. 
I can also associate it with accounts and contacts, other contacts, and even custom objects and opportunities within salesforce.com as well. So I'll type in the subject to discuss opportunity, great. And I can further select a different time and date. I can also pick other invitees from the uh, salesforce.com from the CRM and add them to the, uh, the invitee field down here. Uh, but let's leave it as is. I'll just click Save and Send Invitations. And now this item is saved on my notes calendar. And then as it's saved, it's immediately passed to the CRM. And there's constant synchronization occurring between my notes calendar and the CRM. So you can have one calendar and have everything in one place and handle your schedule accordingly. All right, so let's quickly talk about the task or to-do synchronization and integration. Of course, you can create tasks or to-do in Lotus Notes and they go directly to the CRM. You can associate tasks with contacts, accounts, opportunities, and even custom objects in the CRM. And conversely, tasks created in the CRM get synchronized with Lotus Notes and they stay in sync as time goes on. You can select assignees from the CRM and even view contact information and get a full view of your customer or account uh, from within Notes. Um, so task integration is almost exactly the same as calendar integration. Let's take a look at the live demo. So here's my Lotus Notes task list. And you can see there are tasks already here. Some of them are from the CRM and very similar to the calendar. If I click new here, um, you'll see that I have this area where I can select information from my CRM. So I'll select Adam Jotley and I'll create a task uh, for Adam Jotley. Let's click here. And of course I can select leads, accounts, contacts, opportunities, and even custom objects to associate with this. But let's keep it to Adam Jotley. And I'll set a reminder really to call him about the opportunity. And I can open Adam Jotley in salesforce.com. I can uh, assign additional um, assignees for this task set a due date, all the things you can do in Lotus Notes, but with integration with salesforce.com. Click Save and Close. And now this is actually saved in my Lotus Notes task list. And it's right here, but it's also saved in the CRM. So it's in both places and there's constant synchronization of these tasks. So you can find all your tasks in one place right here. So let's talk a little bit about the personal address book or notes uh, address book integration. When you get an email from a new contact or a new lead, you can very quickly and easily save that lead in salesforce.com or in the CRM. You can search the CRM for uh, contacts and actually save them in your local personal address book and uh, do the opposite as well, copy contacts from your personal address book right up to the CRM. And it has two-way synchronization, so it's always in sync. I'll point out also that anything in your Lotus Notes personal address book uh, typically automatically passes to your mobile device if you're syncing that as well. So it's very powerful. Let's take a look at the, uh, the demo now. Okay, so here I am in my inbox and I'll show the address book integration from the inbox. I'll open this message. And if this message is from someone that's not in my CRM, I can very quickly add it to contacts or add it to leads. I'll click on add it to leads. And you can see it pops up this window, fills in the information it can automatically. And I can fill in the rest of the information manually if I like. Click create and it creates this in salesforce.com, it's that easy. Okay, and then in the address book itself, let's go to the address book. Um, you'll see that there's a new view added, which has the contacts that are both in the CRM and in uh, my Lotus Notes local address book here. And you can see that I can download items. So if I click download contacts from CRM, or sync, it'll actually synchronize uh, the contacts 
to and from the CRM, and it does this on an ongoing basis. So your contacts can be here, and they're also passed to your mobile device if your Lotus Notes application is actually connected to your mobile device. So it's a very quick and easy way to get contacts locally here in your personal address book in Lotus Notes, as well as on your mobile device, and then keep them synchronized as time goes on. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about what makes us different. Although other products provide basic functionality, we have additional functionality like automated email sync, uh, among other things. And then we have server-to-server -server side synchronization, so everything always stays up to date, and it helps with scalability and performance. We have customers with thousands of users on this product. Um, there's also a single centralized Domino server-based install for all users. So that means you can install this product from the Domino server and uh, actually deploy it to everyone without visiting every uh, PC or every desktop. And of course, there's no DLLs or anything to install on each PC. It's all controlled centrally from the Domino server. Uh, unlike other solutions, we also support Mac clients as well as uh, we, we also have a multilingual version of the product so it can talk your language, if you will. I believe the installation and administration piece is key to our solution in terms of managing uh, a product like this for a large number of users. So definitely contact us if you need anything. And here's all the contact information. Thank you for your time today. Um, our U.S. phone numbers there, our email, and you can also visit our website and get a free trial of the product if you'd like. Thank you again and have a great day.